Sup, y'all. So, if you guys didn't know, Murat Gassiev had his heavyweight debut over in his country, his home country, Russia, against Nuri Seferi. Fight ended in the first round with Murat Gassiev winning the fight by TKO. It was pretty much an easy win. Easy win for uh, Murat Gassiev. Um, he landed the big right that dropped Nuri Seferi and it was all over. It was simply like that. <laughs> to be honest, I thought Seferi quit. I thought he quit. Uh, uh, if you haven't seen the fight, uh, I'll show a little bit of it. Uh, shout out to Tim Baxio who posted up a little bit of it on uh, Twitter. Um, yeah, you, you see, you see uh, Gassiev just stalking, stalking, and then he lands a big right. Lands a big right over the guard of Nuri Seferi. Pretty much this punch right here. That's pretty much the punch that knocked him out or knocked him down. So he, dro he, he lands it. Nuri Seferi goes down. Referee starts counting. Um, he gets up at the count of like eight or nine. And you see him stumbling a little bit. And referee told him to walk to him, and he didn't. Oh, actually, he did quit. Scratch that. Scratch that. He he was just dazed. I thought he quit at first, the first time I saw it, because I thought he 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 was like, yeah, I don't want to fight anymore. But it looks like he was definitely dazed. That big right hand was just too much for um, Nuri Seferi. Um, so scratch what I said earlier. He did not quit. He was just hurt. He he couldn't go to the referee. I completely missed that for some reason <laughs> so anyway Murat Gassiev improves to 27 wins one loss 20 wins come by way of knockout TKO now obviously his one and only loss came from this man right here Alexander Uzak um, but now uh, Gassiev is now in the heavyweight division and uh, it'll be interesting to see how he'll do 30 pounds man 30 pounds jump he looks big he looks big I didn't realize how big he looked but he, he looks definitely a lot bigger compared to when he was fighting Cruiserweight. Um, 30 pounds jump for him. Uh, Nuri Safari suffers his 10th loss, second time being stopped. The other time he got stopped was way back in 20, 2001, early in his career. So this is the second time he got stopped. Um, yeah, that big right hand was just too much for Mr. Safari. So, when it comes to what's next, heavyweight division, obviously there's uh, two champions, Tyson Fury and Anthony Joshua. Um, Uzik, his cruiserweight rival, has pretty much solidified himself after defeating uh, Chisora. Now it's time for Murat Gassiev to prove himself too in this heavyweight division. And it'll be interesting to see him fight any of these top 15 fighters in any of this, this list, any of them. Adam Kaunaski, Charles Martin, Chris Ariola, Ajit Kabayel, Michael Hunter, Dak Chisora, uh, Pulev, F.A. Jagba, Sergey Kuzmin, um, you know, Zile Zhang. You know, honestly, any of these fighters, any of all these fighters would be a good fight right now for Murat Gassiev. And hopefully we see those fights. Hopefully those are the fights we see next for him. I think... Uh, it's a good stay busy fight this one was um that's the way i look at it it's just a stay busy fight um obviously with the pandemic going on it's a little harder to get or to make the big fights um you know not crowds are not really allowed in or big crowds are not really allowed right now in arenas uh but uh i'm hoping that next year things will be back to normal and uh, Murat Gasseb will be back to being active uh, hopefully we don't have to wait two years for him to fight like this time. That's can you guys believe that's like two freaking years, man? That's a lot of time wasted. But anyway, congrats to Murat Gassiev on the win. If you saw the fight, which I just showed you, let's see that knockout. Let's see the knockout one more time. It's a big right hand that landed right here. Ooh, oh my God! Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful right hand over the guard. Anyway. Let me know your thoughts. Thank you so much for listening and watching. Do not forget to hit that like button if you haven't yet. Please do not forget to subscribe if you haven't yet. Please and like always have a great day. Alright, thanks.